Someone gave me this challenge to tell better stories, uh, sort of like a 2022 resolution, and this is my first crack at it. I was scuba diving in Belize, and I had just bought these massive video lights for my camera, so I was super gung-ho about getting interesting video shots. Uh, I think this was the first or maybe the second uh, night dive of the trip, I don't quite remember, but we bumped into this shoal of squid and they were actually super cool. Uh, they swam around the reef and we followed them and uh, in the process we saw a bunch of uh, really interesting things. Kind of like they were showing us their backyard, if you will, you know, that type of thing. But, but one of them, this one, really liked me uh, for some reason or maybe it liked my lights, I don't know. So it split from the group and what is the reasonable thing to do when you're diving in the ocean at night? Um, you also split from your group and you follow a freaking squid into the pitch black oblivion that is the ocean at night. So naturally, naturally that's what I did. Um, so I went on a little private tour with the squid. Uh, it showed me this uh, basket star that had just caught a fish. I'd never seen a basket star catch a fish before. Um, I saw this uh, slipper lobster walking on the ocean floor. Uh, it showed me a couple of really cool, uh, colorful flamingo tongues. But then it just started to to um, to sprint ahead and and break away from me. But then it would it would wait for me to catch up. It did this a few times until I was far away from my group. I I could hardly see their lights. Uh, I couldn't hear the boat, so no light pollution, no noise pollution, it was just me and this squid. And we are over this sandy grassy patch um, where the squid just stayed in front of my lens and didn't move for probably 20 minutes. So I set up my tripod on the ocean floor and this is some of what I captured. You can see all the cool color changes and all the subtle pattern changes on the body of this squid and just how gorgeous this animal is. Um, you know, I think I got what I set out to get, uh, which was to try out my lights, get some interesting footage. But in the process, I also, I feel like I had this little experience uh, with a squid. Um, so I don't know what that is, I don't know what to make of it, if, whether it was just luck or some coincidence or, or, I don't know what that was. But yeah, this is my story about the time I got a private uh, scuba diving tour from a squid.